President Joe Biden said Thursday Americans were really, really down. Hess right about that. A new USA Today slash Suffolk poll shows the country in a funk and one that sets a problematic political landscape for Democrats in the November elections that are approaching fast. Control of the Senate, now divided 50 to 50, is harder to predict. Independents now say they would vote for the Republican over the Democrat for Congress, 32% to 27%. But 40% are undecided, a sign that these key voters haven't yet made up their minds, or perhaps haven't yet focused on the election. Americans have been downbeat all year, and their attitudes have gotten a bit more pessimistic than they were at the beginning of the year. In a USA Today slash Suffolk poll in February, Biden's approval rating was also 39%, then, 44% strongly disapproved. Then, 65% saw the country going in the wrong direction, 22% said it was on the right track. Then, the congressional ballot was divided 39% Democrat, 37% Republican. People are really, really down, Biden said in an interview Thursday with the Associated Press, blaming the pessimism on the trauma of the COVID-19 pandemic. He also blamed the rising cost of gasoline and food for driving down his approval rating and the nation's mood. If you want the direct barometer of what people are going to talk about at the kitchen table and the dining room table and whether things are going well, it's the cost of food and what's to see. But he said they should be confident because I am confident about the future. The poll of 1, 0, 0, 0 registered votes, taken by Landline and Cell Phone Sunday through Wednesday, has a margin of error of plus or minus 3, 1 percentage points.